Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Richie from Boston. Today's the 5th of December, 2017, and it's really starting to freak me out how every video that myself, Nicholson, Kev Baker, True Stream Media, so many channels have put up over the years, warning about, talking about, speculating about, are now just magazine articles. This is in Futurism Magazine, and they're talking about the military testering, testing mood-altering AI-controlled brain plants in humans. That should terrify you. And yet, many people don't even care. They're not even paying attention. Mood-altering means they can alter your mood. Are you happy? They can alter that and make you terrified. Are you scared? They can terror they can alter that and make you happy. And it's all controlled by an AI and it's the military. The military's job was to protect the country from being attacked by other countries and yet now people cheer for the military like it's a sport team, USA, USA, even when they're going door to door kicking in doors looking for an imaginary subject. This was Boston. This was Boston. They're looking for some teenager that set off an explosive somehow while they were having a drill. Meanwhile, myself, Richie from Boston, left because I could see the writing on the wall. This is the military. This is Jade Helm. This is them going door to door. And meanwhile, people were chanting USA as though this was somehow a good thing. And we were upholding the standards of the country. You do not want your military, I repeat, you do not want your military having the ability to alter your moods. And yet it's old news. It's old news. We warned you. We told you. We put up with the people calling us conspiracy theorists, tinfoil hatters, so forth, so on, and blah, blah, blah. Well, everything we were telling you about is here now. If they're telling you about this in magazines and newspaper articles, it's done. Now, this is the Daily Star. This is very similar to the newspaper I found myself in a couple of days ago. And it's it's the equivalent. Oh, let me make sure there's no nudity over here on the side because that's what these guys do. It's the equivalent of the National Enquirer, so forth and so on. But here we go. Google's supercomputer creates its own AI child. Awesome. Absolutely awesome. But this is what these people are doing. This is what they strive for. You have to understand that the people that are creating these things, the people that are getting the information from other dimensions and putting it to use in our physical realm, are also the people that think having a baby or a child with a robot is completely natural and no big deal, and the mainstream media runs with it. They absolutely run with it. This is a robot right here on the left. Do you see what I'm saying? These people want, they're already sleeping with robots. They're already having sex with robots. They're actually selling like the proverbial hot cake. They tell us the world is overpopulated, yet people are trying to reproduce with robot dolls. Something's wrong here, people. You were warned. Everyone will not see this tidal wave or tsunami, as Jordy Rose calls it, until it engulfs them. Richie from Boston, like, share, subscribe, or don't. I'm out.